One year ago this week, Carolina's healthcare system, Blue Ridge, signed a contract with Apollo MD, the largest emergency medicine physician practice in North Carolina, to oversee our own emergency medicine services in Morganton and Valdez. And at midnight last September 1st, Apollo officially took charge. The initial transition from Mountain Emergency Physicians to Apollo MD went smoothly, but there were, unquestionably, some significant bumps in the road at first. We spoke about that with Medical Director and Chair of our Department of Emergency Medicine, Dr. Michelle Curry. There were certainly challenges, but um, we've progressed on most items a little faster than I had anticipated, um, having gone through other transitions, so I think we're moving along. Um, we've made some real positive changes. We've certainly run into some frustrations, but uh, we're, do we're doing, I think we're doing well. We're, we're getting a good stable core of quality physicians. Our compliment rate is up. Um, I, we get many more compliments than the department used to. Um, so yeah, I think we're headed in the right direction. It was a big job to essentially replace 100% of our physicians and Apollo has stepped up to the plate. They've staffed us well. We've got a great staffing model. Um, the physician quality has, has come quite a long way. Uh, having Dr. Curry on board as our medical director has made my life infinitely better. So I see good stuff coming in the future. Of course, as Dr. Curry tells us, there are still many challenges to overcome. The first challenge we have is, is recruiting physicians uh, stable physicians to the area. Um, that's always a challenge when you're outside of a, a big metro center. We don't like folks to wait. I mean, we are here and when there's a patient to be seen, we see them, we take care of them, we move on. Um, but we can't always get to them because there's other patients. Um, and so the throughput issues, that's a huge issue and there's many, many little pieces, little moving parts of that. We had some big cultural shifts as far as nursing goes, um, adjusting for them, I'm sure they would say the challenge was adjusting to a new group of providers with a different mindset. And also for them, I think a challenge has been that's, that they're seeing a lot of doctors come and go, so they're having a hard time getting to know some of the physicians. That has improved really quite a bit. They were not quite as empowered in the past, or used to operating independently. And, we really encourage that. I work very hard with David Everhart to in, empower the nurses and encourage them to ask questions. We're doing a lot more bedside teaching. We're really pushing some, some initiatives on their behalf that they can go ahead and start some care procedures when the physician is not immediately available. Over the next 12 months, says Dr. Curry, our emergency departments will implement several new initiatives, all designed to improve emergency department flow and function. We're looking at some lab-based initiatives so that our laboratory tests get drawn and run faster. We're looking at our mental health patients. That's a, a huge drain on our bed space and um, on provider time and on nursing time. And then another huge throughput um, measure that we've just started is um, with David Everhart uh, looking at something called a clinical decision unit. For those patients we know need to come into the hospital, but we're not 100% sure which floor, which specialties, or which things, it's a, a place that they can be a little more comfortable and also open up a few more emergency beds for those folks who are waiting. Despite the many challenges faced over the past several months, Dr. Curry has been consistently impressed with the quality of Carolina's healthcare system Blue Ridge's emergency departments. I think the department here um, is already very good and the potential here to be one of the one of what what I call a center for excellence in emergency medicine and that's a phrase that people say and are pat about but that's a phrase I use in my recruiting I say I am building a center for excellence in emergency medicine and I want you to be part of the team the nursing staff here is fabulous um, I, I have great relationships with the director of the lab with the director of radiology I think all the pieces are here and really I think this is a very good emergency department <laughs>